To create a sketch rendering with color, first of all we have to choose a view of our model. And then when we go to our photo render settings, we've got to make sure that we size the Lightworks. I'm actually going to render it with Lightworks. We have to size it to the 3D window. And I'm actually going to put a depth Q on it here. And I'm going to make that 40 meters. You can play around with this. This figure won't work in every model. So just increase it and decrease it until it looks good. Background, make sure the background color is white. Because if it's black, the screen will be all black. Then if I push OK, now if I render it without the depth cue, it will look similar to this. Now if I render it with the depth cue, so now I have to save this file save as I'm just going to save it to the documents file but I'm going to save it as a TIFF image now I'm going to go to the photo rendering settings this time I'm going to change to the sketch rendering engine and I'm going to use this setting here so I know it looks good air perspective I put this up to about 40 and then I uncheck use background alpha channel and there are other parameters that you can play around with here but I'm just going to leave everything there and to the background I'm going to choose the picture that I just had before first of all I have to make sure that it's in a loaded library here it is here I'm going to add it and reload the libraries once reloaded I can open the file, so that's my background now. And once I push OK, because the image I'm about to render is going to be the same size as this, it's going to sketch render exactly the same image over this background. And I'm going to photo render it. And here's the result of that rendering. I might just do another one with slightly different settings. I'm going to turn the vectorial hatching off and change that to a felt tip once again I'm going to turn that off put that up to 40 and push OK and photo render that again And here's that same rendering with the hatching turned off.